Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Zach and I have been driving all night. We drove from Iowa out to Colorado. We're going skiing for a week. This video is just gonna be a little bit of here, a little bit of there, kind of the highlights. So sit back and enjoy. No farming content in this one. It's just vacation. Look at this view. Oh my goodness. Hopefully you didn't pick a bad place like the last time we went skiing. Five star resort last time. <laughs> if we get in the room, don't go in and plug the toilet and then go down and say you don't want the room. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, this is cool. Oh, we have a fireplace. You did a better job picking this place than the last one, Zach. Good job. Wait until you go into the bed. There could be bed bugs. We've had that happen before too. <laughs> did anyone leave ice cream? Oh. Cheap people oh, not leaving us anything. Oh. By the way, guys, this is my old college roommate, Zach. Formerly known as the John friend Deere. who came from John Deere to steal all the red ideas and then bring them back to John Deere. But he doesn't work for John Deere anymore because they found out what he was doing. And uh, I don't know, something about lawsuits and jail time. I, it's his problem. Holy cow, would you do a lot of fire in here? I've seen bricks have a closer resemblance to bacon <laughs> than this bacon is. Drop it! walking across the parking lot with groceries. Oh, oh, that's unfortunate. The door just locked as soon as he went to go grab the handle. I, I don't know what happened. It just locked when he went to grab it. All right, Zach, give us the rundown. What's going on? So Cole says that mustard and onion is the way to go with brats. I like ketchup and mayo or ketchup and mustard. So we're gonna see if it's actually as good as what he says. I'm actually uh, really surprised with how it with how it turned out. Do you lie awake at night? Are you afraid to turn out the lights? Is there something you're scared of? What's there out in the dark? Make sure to keep all your windows locked. Do you do you surrender? <laughs> I just hit my knee. Here's one for the lonely hearts. For the ones that fear the dark, you better run out, run out, out of here. Bet you can look the other way. Here's one for the broken road. That's the only one you know. You better run out, run out, truth or dare. Get me out, take me anywhere but here. Oh, anywhere but here. How are we doing today? Good, thanks. How are you? Awesome. Now, most people would think I was going down this unmarked run that had powder on it and I fell and I got stuck upside down. But that's not really what happened. Uh, actually, it kind of is. I gotta admit, guys, we 
definitely don't have views like this in Iowa. I think Zach's hiding somewhere in that tree, probably eating yellow snow. It was your fault. You made me do it. <laughs> yep. I remember when they invented skis. I was nine years old. Tree! One. That tree had feelings. It doesn't have feelings anymore. smokes we are currently stuck in Zach's truck we accidentally lost the keys and uh, we can't drive without them so we're kind of sitting here it's a Saturday afternoon so um, yeah stand by we had tried calling the people on the center council of the truck for like I don't know 30 minutes or so and they basically said they couldn't help us but they could help us get a tow truck we didn't want to have to get a tow truck if we didn't have to and all the locksmiths around were closed we tried calling three of them two of them i tried calling the car dealership but they said they didn't have anybody until monday right now it's saturday night so we kind of had no options but then the one locksmith that we called initially called back got a hold of them and they have the stuff so they're coming out they're going to reprogram it and we're gonna get back able to run the truck. Good job, Zach. <laughs> now just watch the little timer thing run out here and at least get towed before the guy gets here. <laughs> oh yeah, and by the way, did I also tell you guys that Zach led us to the wrong village so we had to walk a mile back to the truck? I don't even know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> you ready for your thousand dollar bill? <laughs> Good job, Zach. Here's your three hundred and fifty dollar key. I don't know if I can be responsible enough to hold this anymore. All right, I'll, I'll take it. Sorry guys, I keep flapping when I'm in the air. It's a sad day guys, we're done. Oh, I need my pit vipers on. I'm glad I went through the link in the description and got 15% off. How many miles did we ski? We did 202 miles in eight days of uh, skiing and snowboarding. And Bert, 224,000. Okay, I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> Have fun with this 12 hour drive. I 